full-blown mental meltdown in the middle of my class. I'm seeing symbols. We've kept much from you, Sam. This isn't my war. I fear it soon will be. It's time for Movie Month. It is my third annual Movie Month, in which I will be watching 30 movies in 30 days, and I'll either hate them or give them praise. Well, that just happened. I literally wanted this episode to end with just that. I wanted to have the beginning, have the song, have me say, well, that just happened, and then just end it. I think that would have been awesome, but I do kind of want to talk about this a little bit. (coughs) Excuse me. So, Transformers. Transformers 2. This, this, This movie may seem out of nowhere because so far I've been watching pretty much pretty recent movies. Um, But just to, as a kind of, to go back, I've never seen Transformers 2, 3, 4, and now there's going to be a 5. I saw the original Transformers years ago and it was okay. It was just, it was, it was okay. And I just never saw any of the sequels. And it's a, just another one of those series where I thought, you know, I probably would like to see these things. I know they're supposed to be stupid and dumb. Um, but I sometimes I like stupid and dumb. So tonight I watched Stupid and Dumb, Transformers, Revenge of the Fallen. And is the Fallen uh, Megatron? No, the Fallen is the name of a dude. Yep, he's a, or a Transformer. I'm not going to go through. Yesterday I did a half hour on on. Uh, terminated. I couldn't believe I did that long, but I enjoyed talking about it. This one, it's going to be a lot shorter, as you can already tell you. We're probably mostly most of the way there. Um, really quick. Years ago, I was like eager for the world to learn who Shia LaBeouf is and become this giant superstar. Uh, I was a big fan of Even Stevens, and, and, and again, that was a kids show, and I was already old enough to be uh, to be you know too old for it, but. I had a friend who he watched it with his daughter and got me into it. And I, I really loved it. And I thought he was great in it. Like so ridiculous. And then he made holes and I thought that was great. I thought this guy, this kid is going to be going some places. Then he's in the Transformers movie. And, you know, since then he's seemed to have kind of snapped a little, gone a little cuckoo, uh, but he's still a great actor. So, um, it's weird seeing him in this, thinking he probably hates being there the whole time. Uh, and then and there's another one and with him in it. And then, of course, Marky Mark takes over. I clicked. I was doing, you know, searching about this movie today. And um, I see that there is going to be Transformers. I think it's called The Last Night. And somebody said, oh, there's going to be a big surprise in it. Is it going to be Shia LaBeouf coming back? I can't see that happening. But I don't know. You you. You never know. You, you don't know how this 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 weirdo acts, um, and and you liked him to kind of get his shit together and and you know go back to making good fun movies because the 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 kid can be a really good fun actor, um, even when he's surrounded by transforming robots and and piles and piles of garbage. Because this movie was pretty dumb. Um, there was a lot of huge great action moments. And a lot of them I was listening to while my eyes were closing because it was boring at points and I didn't care. Um, and yet I'm going to probably watch three and I'm probably going to watch four at some point. I, I don't think I'm going to be watching these uh, three days in a row. I, I will. Um, I don't think I can do it. Uh, it was weird because like you look at Michael Bay. And he, Michael Bay likes to put the camera low and give high angles of things. He likes to kind of look up um, Megan Fox's ass. Uh, he, he likes to be, he likes to make things a little gratuitous and, and, and dumb. Like the whole thing with the college and the girl coming onto him, and it turns out the girl was actually a robot, so maybe that's why she was coming onto him so much. But just everything felt like Michael Bay thought, well, this is how college is, or this is how people are, or, or like the mother having a pot brownie and then trap uh, tackling somebody and, buying something and not recognizing the big weed sign on it. And this, this is college. 
Um, and this is how moms act. And the, you know, I love the actor who plays his dad. He's great on Veep. Um, the mom is a good actress, but she just was given real silly, silly stuff to do. And, you know, they go to France and there's a mime and they're eating escargot. Like every, hey, this is what people do. Let's think of it. Um, during, at one point during the movie, uh, Nickelback came on and I thought, huh, that makes sense. You know, where you listen to a Nickelback song and technically there's nothing wrong with it. It's a well-produced, uh, polished m a piece of music that just uh, doesn't resonate and feels a little empty. Um, at least with me. Uh, and there you go. There's the trans there's Transformers 2 right there. Um, that's all I really wanted to say. I wanted to get that Nickelback thing out there. I thought that was, I was like, oh, brilliant. And talk about Shia LaBeouf and the mother. Um, and hey, there's a Tyrese again. Uh, you know, I've apparently I've seen him in a movie now where he isn't fast or furious, uh, though, you know, and he wasn't as jokey, which isn't good. Um, but I was like, hey, I know that guy. And I actually like that guy, which is funny because I didn't think I'd ever say that, but I do. And I did. Um, so yeah, that's really it for Transformers 2 for me. You know, we're starting, uh, I'm, I'm in a week now where it's Monday through Friday. I, I'm not going into the office at all this week. I am working this week for four days, but I'm staying home every day. So there is no built-in commute where I can sit down and watch these movies. So I'm not really sure what movies I'm going to be watching. I do have the next two Transformers if I'm ready to go. I have a dumb comedy sequel that I've been holding off on. I have uh, another action movie. I have a, a, a really straight-to-DVD cheesy horror sequel that I've been sitting on. I have this little horror movie from a, a well-known director that I've been sitting on. And all those may be used, or I may just go up on Netflix and, and find something. There's a couple of documentaries on Netflix I'm looking forward to. But no matter what, there will be another movie tomorrow and another podcast for day 13. But this is day 12. In day 12, I chose Transformers Revenge of the Fallen or something like that. Uh, basically, Transformers 2. Thank you guys for listening. And thank you for sticking with us for the first 12 days. And I hope you stick with me for as long as I can. This Friday is going to be tough. Unless I get up really early and watch a movie, I don't know if I'll be podcasting. Um, I'm going to try, though. Saturday is going to be tough and Sunday is going to be tough. They're all going to be tough because of... Uh, going, I'm going away to visit family. So you may see a, 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 a kind of a hole in the podcasting for the upcoming weekend, but you won't see a hole in as far as the movies and you won't see a hole as far as the posts. Those are still happening no matter what. Now, how can you find me? I'm on Twitter at Geek Mentality. The website's on Twitter at fans.experts. You can find us on facebook.com slash fans.experts. You can find us at fans.experts.com. And always search for the hashtag FNE Movie Month. That's how you'll find every post. Uh, and and I, I, I beg of you to retweet. I beg of you to like us on Facebook. I beg of you to uh, follow us on Twitter and subscribe to the podcast. You can also see us on SoundCloud, soundcloud.com slash FNE Movie Month for now. I use the free um, option. You only get three hours. So pretty soon I'm moving on to FNE Movie Month 2. I already have it ready to go. Uh, so that all 30 episodes can be, um, or I say 30 episodes, there probably won't be, but every episode I possibly can get up onto SoundCloud will get up onto SoundCloud no matter what. Now, that's it. All done. Uh, hmm, what else do I have to say? Oh yeah, here's my music. This is my podcast, I made it. Geek Mentality is what I named it. And I think you should listen and subscribe Cause I'm kinda funny and awesome I think that I'm worth your time And I'm kinda handsome My mom says Please listen and Please subscribe At least listen to this episode That's not experts